Yep. Just uploading another video for you guys. Because you guys are awesome. That's why. So, here's my computer. Nothing much. My hard drive. Fortunately, it's uh oh, it's on. Can't really tell. So yeah, it's on. <laughs> it's my wireless internet. It's got a bunch of papers on top of it. No big deal. And there's my cable. Or keep on saying mine. But there's our cable internet. Not DSL unfortunately but this is cable internet is way better from time water cable so yeah um my our lights this light is actually better because it's giving me more better quality videos I guess so anyways I picked up something can't really show you quite yet, but I picked up something. What was it like on Saturday? Um, let me see the exact dates. The day I picked it up. It was on Saturday, November fourteenth. So that was like, um. Yeah, this this Saturday, but it's not the weekend anymore, unfortunately. No, <laughs> slowly working on to the weekday. Ugh. Another boring week. But this week, I have to start living up life. Looking for a job, of course. Maybe I might work with my cousin. I'm not quite sure. We'll see. But that's not what I'm going to talk to you about. You're going to love this. Now, as I show you, you're going to be like, Really? That's pretty level. Check it out. Yeah, you're probably wondering why. You're not going to believe this. I actually... Well, my stepdad got it for me. And I was very pleased that he did. So, there it is. It's a soft pad. Not compared to my DDR metal pad that I have here. I am thinking about buying a Kobex Flux. We'll see. Those things are like 300 bucks. I don't know. Maybe. Because money is tight right now and I have to start saving. But I am hacking this one. Or trying to. That must be kind of dumb. <laughs> but I got this one for like 20 bucks from Craigslist. So, in case if you're wondering, that is a pretty good deal. The left arrow hardly worked at all, so I saw a pretty legitimate website that you can make your own DDR pads that at a mill. So, interesting. But, my stepdad got me this one, and I'm pretty happy because, believe it or not, this soft pad here is the one with the foam inside. And the zipper, you can even unzip it and take the foam out and take it with you when you're done. But believe it or not, I got this at the Goodwill. And I was like, what kind of moron will throw away or, you know, donate a DDR pad? I guess he doesn't want to play DDR anymore. I don't know. But... Usually these soft pads are like 30 bucks over at Best Buy or Fry's Electronics or or wherever else that has them. But 
The people at the Goodwill store over in Van Nuys, they were selling this thing for like, let me see, like, look, for like seven dollars. Isn't that amazing? Well, seven dollars and ninety-nine cents, but who cares? I don't know what the G stands for, but um, I guess they marked that down or something. But I don't know. I, I like it. Ain't nothing compared to uh, the DDR Champion pad with a metal bar and all that, you know. But seven dollars and shockingly, it works. It does work. I've tried it on DDR Max 2 on my PS2 because uh, it's modded and it still works. But I'm thinking about hooking this up to my computer. Yes, this is my computer because I got this one from for my birthday gift. Yeah, so... <laughs> There's my subwoofer. I don't know if you can really see it. There's my PS2 USB box. And yes, it is a PS2 controller. See? And I was like, sweet. It's in pretty good condition, too. The whole thing works. Literally. Not bad for $7 versus, uh,. 30 bucks plus tax. Pretty fair deal. I'm hoping that there'll be another Goodwill up in um, Eagle Rock in that area. If you don't live in the LA area, um, that's okay. But <laughs> if there's a Goodwill store that has another one of these pads, I know it looks ugly because it's yellowish and got that weird yellowish color. Same thing with the blue arrow. I don't know why. I like the original version better. The arcade version, you know. But hey, what do you expect for seven dollars? <laughs> Not bad. Or eight dollars. Because it's seven ninety nine. <laughs> but hey, if you guys ever decide to find something at the Goodwill, why not? Because, you know, it was a good deal. I don't shop at the Goodwill as I normally do, or not. I don't usually shop there. I go to places like the Glendale Galleria Mall and, uh, you know, hang around there. But I might do some more video vlogs over there. I don't know. We'll see. Because I do live in California, Los Angeles. How many of you that don't live out here in L.A.? You know, come out here in L.A. It's awesome. I don't say why not. Of course, maybe, maybe for you guys that you don't want to come out. But this is L.A., Los Angeles, you know. So, anyways, my video is almost up. So... There's your update for, well, just a fun update. So, yeah. Anyways, catch you all later. Um, I am going to possibly play with this uh, next weekend. Starting November. Uh, let's see. November. What is it, a weekday now? Yeah, probably... Probably Sunday on the 22nd, or... On the 21st of Saturday. We'll see. That depends. If I don't get a job by then, I'm gonna be like, oh, I need to start working now, because Christmas is coming up. Not to mention Thanksgiving is coming up in a couple of weeks. Wow, that's fast, you guys. So, you know, a lot of things are happening. So, you might get lucky. You're probably thinking that, Oh, why is um, Jason still 
chilling on YouTube or stuff like that when he's supposed to be, you know, doing other things. I do do a lot of other things. I'm not just, like, sitting at home doing everything else, so, you know. But, yeah, in the meantime, you get lucky and you'll see a video here and there, so, yeah. There is my daily schedule right there. Cool. Catch you all later. God bless. Peace.